Hi, I am Dr. Chinmayi. I am a fetal medicine specialist. Now, fetal medicine is a new branch in obstetrics and gynecology. We have traditionally learned that in pregnancy, a pregnant woman goes to the doctor to see the doctor. The doctor sees the woman and treats her. But actually, there are two patients in this question. One is the mother herself. The other is the baby which is growing inside the mother. And this baby is the focus of this new branch of medicine called fetal medicine. So you see this baby grow inside as a small mass of cells and then you see how it develops into an amazing miracle of nature. It develops into a complete human being and you see it growing through stages and finally you welcome this baby as a new member of your family. The fetal medicine doctor helps you assess how the baby is growing, where, are there any problems with the growth of the baby, are there any problems with the structure of the baby and if there are then what are the solutions. So in fetal medicine we look at this unborn baby and trace it through the journey before life and help you welcome a new member into your family happily. There are some problems which happen when more than one babies are in the womb. That is called multiple pregnancy which is now either twins or triplets or even quadruplets. In those situations the food supply to the baby, the way the babies are placed inside the womb, all that may vary and there may be specific interventions needed to ensure that all these babies come out happily. That's one very important aspect which is followed in fetal medicine. The other issue is if the babies have some structural abnormality which can be possible in about 2-3% to of all pregnancies. In those situations, the fetal medicine specialist will help you time your delivery, will help you plan the place of delivery and will help you plan further care. For example, if the baby needs surgery after birth, then your timing has to be optimized so that you deliver at a place where the newborn specialist takes over the care of the baby and then surgery is arranged. And we inside decide when is the optimal time for all this to happen. In many cases, babies don't grow very well. That's called intrauterine growth restriction. If this condition is not detected, then the babies get compromised inside and when they come out, they have functional disturbances. So a fetal medicine doctor helps you assess the growth of the baby and give you inputs as to how to optimize the growth of that baby and also in growth restricted babies, optimize the time of delivery. So there are a number of specific requirements that are specific to this unborn child and addressing all these issues is the remit of this new science called fetal medicine. One very important issue is genetic and chromosome problems. We have come to realize the importance of these problems as they are being better identified. There are more advances happening in molecular biology and clinical genetics so that we have learned that these are the problems which happen again and again because of defective genes. Thankfully, we now have methods of checking these genes. So the fetal medicine specialist can screen for these conditions if necessary, even test the unborn baby so that if a baby has a major problem, it may not come into this world and suffer because to some extent we can minimize the suffering in conditions affecting families repeatedly. So overall this is a very uh, new branch but it is a very upcoming branch and now the relevance of this has come into the field of obstetrics and gynecology because good management of pregnancy involves in ensuring that the baby inside is good because the ultimate outcome of a good pregnancy is a happy mother and a healthy child.